So here we are today, baby. It's April 15th. Uh, I had three doctors tell me I need a shoulder surgery. Today, we are headed to see Gary Brecka's doctor, Dr. Carla. Gonna go meet her for the first time. She's gonna do some stem cell injections, PRP, prolozone, some some cool stuff. Very high-end, it's new, but supposedly it works. I'm super, super excited. My boy, buddy, Mikey's flying us in in this plane today. Super excited, praying for good results. Stay tuned. Care about everything. I feel all this pressure to live up to what they tell me I'm gonna be. So I isolate myself. You can't help me, it's on me. I'm hiding any sign of weakness from my guys. So I'm here in Dallas, here to see Dr. Terry Card Carta, who um, is gonna do some treatments on my shoulder, hopefully, so that I do not have to have surgery. But we're super excited about this. We're gonna see how it goes today. Prepare for some pain. Yeah, a little bit of pain, but uh, kind of used to it. Hi, how are you? Here to see Dr. Carta. Yo, oh, yeah. You need one? We'll get you one, man. We'll get you an injection. We'll get you an injection. <laughs> yeah, I'm Phil Benamino. Nice to meet you. Hi, nice Pleasure to meet you. Pleasure talking to you. So I've oh, worked gosh, with Gary. Yeah. Which, which one is it? It's the right one. Right one, okay. The right. one I use every day, the one I need the most. <laughs> So, I can't wait, man. I'm excited. The prayers that this shit works. When you can't do a push up, when you can't lift, I'm, I'm used to, I mean, I hold a record back in college for bench pressing 404 pounds my freshman year. Weighed 165 pounds. So, when you can't even do a push up, it's like, it gets up here, it starts messing with your brain. And then all of a sudden, the quality of life, things that you're supposed to do, like opening a door, you struggle with, it's freaking hard. So, I'm very, very hopeful that, that uh, this is the miracle I've been looking for. We will see. We'll see. So yeah, I'm, I'm nervous and excited. Muscle, the muscle is, yeah, because the we can't do anything over here. Yeah, you definitely have asymmetry. Mm -hmm. uh, you have a lot of muscle change. He's even asymmetrical right For here. Sure. Okay, so let's let's first start with how. Let's do your good side. Let's see how you, how well you do. Okay, now do your bad side. Oh, that's it. Yeah. It's impressive. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Ouch, that fucking hurt. Sorry. Just come down like that. Yeah, down can, do can you can you do this with it? About it. That's about it. You can't get back behind. Oh hell no, no. And what's weird is it hurts here in my tricep too. When I go to there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like it. Okay. Do you have pain? It's up here, and it grinds in here. Yeah, okay. Now, if you notice, if I'm supporting it, he can go up. He can go up more. When he puts this up, when you put it up, you got to put it yeah. on the table. So what's bit. happening to him is he's developing what's called a frozen shoulder. He's getting, he's got a lot of um, adhesions, a lot of. Um, so, so here's what's weird. So I had frozen shoulder from rotator cuff surgery earlier. Mm -hmm. So August of last year, they went in and cleaned that out. Yeah. So I could uh -huh. get back here because I couldn't do that. And I ended up got worse. Like, got worse. So, yeah. 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 Right. Put your hands like this. Okay, push against me. Back. Yeah. Not too bad. No, I just up and up there. Okay, yeah. so, so so okay. Now push in. Yeah. Oh yeah, you're really weak. Okay. Yeah. Well, you got a bad shoulder. That's for sure. Well, let's see what we can do. Let me prepare my stuff, and I'll come back in, and we'll inject you. It's needle sticks. I I, don't, I think you'll be fine with them. As much pain as you feel. Yeah. Okay. Damn. It's okay. It's gonna get better. You should be here. It's gonna work. It's gotta work. Yeah. It's gotta work. It's gonna get better. It has to. You know. So we're looking at his rotator cuff muscles. I'm going to take off some of these bigger muscles here. So we're looking at the um, subscapularis in there. That's where that's where he's. We're going to well address that area because that's where he's weak. All right, and then he has so much tenderness. Let me take this guy off here. This is where he's getting impinged right there. This is the supraspinatus, the rotator cuff muscle. The supraspinatus. That's where he's getting. And the subscapularis are his two big weak areas that seem to be to be an issue. So he's literally pinching on that on that attachment site and that muscle. So I'm going to try to strengthen. I'm going to try to strengthen these legs ligaments up here and get him some benefit if we turn around the back you have the um, remainder of the rotator so that's that supraspinatus there that, that we were looking at earlier right. the infraspinatus and the teres. teres so those right so there's your rotator cuff mus muscles here 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 and then this subscap also once we get him loosened up we might be able to Get, we might be able to free up some of those adhesions right. too. If this doesn't work, then that's your option. You're going to have to do a, a traditional surgical approach. Um, and, and I know you'd like to avoid that if you can. 1,000%. Yeah, yeah. 1, we can, we will. <sighs> do you want me to tell you when I'm going to stick you? Uh, you going to numb it or no? Nope, we're just going to go right oh, in. You should never Ready? Go. Okay. Stick. My keys. You good? Yeah. Okay, that's what it feels like, okay? 
pressure. Yeah, okay. for pressure. Yeah. Great. You all right? Go slow. I just want it to work. I know. I know you do. Can I have the heat set on here? Should be fairly pressure. Right? Yeah. Not pain, just pressure, right? Yeah, which creates pain, yeah. Which creates pain? <laughs> well, that's, that's fair statement. Okay. What was that? Mm -hmm. You all right? Yeah. Okay. Just hot. Yeah, yeah. Okay. More pressure, more pressure. Yep. More pressure, yeah. more pressure. You good? Yeah, great. Fantastic. All right, exit them. Exit. Yeah, I'm almost done with this part, okay? Deep breath in through your nose and out through your mouth. Perfect. You did great with that. So tender. You okay? Yeah. I'm in the spot, aren't I? Oh, yeah. Okay, let's have some those. Mm -hmm. The full one or the half one? What, oh, so? Mm -hmm. Half's fine. You okay? Yep. Okay. <laughs> B12 in it, that's why it's pink. Just yeah, I'm there, aren't I? Feel that? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, pressure, yeah. there's pressure, oh. there's that pressure oh. right there. Yeah, that's that the pressure. One. Yeah, that's the. For the same oh. You okay? That oh. muscle ain't big right there, what she's talking Fuck. Okay, you good? Yeah, that one hurt bad. Okay. Almost done, I'll just be in it just a second longer, okay? Yeah. Deep breath in through your nose. Okay. Good. Good. To ease it up a little bit. Okay. You don't have any neck pain or anything, do you? It's all shoulder? No, it's a right there. Yeah. Feel that pressure? Yep. Okay. This will be really good for me. I just hope so. Okay. All right. We might be done with shots. Let's just see. Let's move you around here, okay? Okay. Does that at least make you feel good that we might be done with shots? <laughs> Let's move you around and do some moving. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Okay. It's higher. It's definitely higher. No, I think you're good. Okay. What did we put in me? What did we do? Anyway? So we did. We did. What did we put in? I know we put a lot in there. So we did. Um, we did a biologic, which is a, a, a from the umbilical cord, not yours, right. your cells. We did. We did umbilical cord cells so so we could modulate that healing response right talk to all your cells and get everything going just like when you were a kid you know mm. just go back and heal let's put everything all our power to healing i did ozone therapy and B12, then i had right? a little b12 in there for the nerves and the tissue so i just i just try to hit it from multiple ways okay. multiple ways of healing then we did some range of motion to try to break up some of that scar tissue so, so what people, what you're very good about doing is when people hurt, they tend they to lean. They lean, and he doesn't. I mean, you, you're trained him well. He's, you know, you're work, you're making the shoulder work. You're not doing this. Right. So that's good. Just pop to that one level. Yeah, that's okay. Fixing that right there. That's fine. I know that freaks you out. Mm -hmm. Will that ever go away? You think? Um, that's probably that probably as you get stronger, it might get better. It probably never totally go away because that that's where you get the grinding. Bone bone. Yeah, that's where you get the grinding. Mm -hmm. okay. So you want to strengthen the muscles around it, and you will feel better and better. 
and, and it might even be at that six week mark that you're, okay, now I'm really, I've, 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 I've had people complain of shoulder pain and at six weeks they kind of start really turning around. You're moving better. You're definitely moving. I mean, you're definitely moving better. Good I donate. appreciate you being absolutely. responsive. Absolutely. <laughs> thank you so much. Yeah. Perfect. Thank okay, you. Okay, good deal. Great. You feel okay? Yeah, no, I feel good. Headed or anything? No, no, I like it. All right. Good. I appreciate it. Thank you. Now the pressure's off. Yeah, I think you're going to. I think we can get some stuff done here. I'm excited. This will be good. We'll see how we do. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Thank absolutely. you so much. All right, guys. Nice what do you think, man? I don't know. We'll see, man. I'll be honest. It is a looser. It feels looser. You know, I'm hopeful. I'm here for a reason, man. I, I don't think things happen by accident. I think you meet people, things happen for a reason. And this woman, awesome. She made a way to meet me today and get it done. So I'm, I'm hopeful it's going to help me. Glad to be.